How do you test a coil on an ignition coil with a multimeter? First, make sure that the vehicle's ignition system is off before you begin. Next, disconnect the coil pack from the engine. Then, attach your multimeter to the terminals of the coil pack. Finally, switch on your multimeter and measure the resistance of the coil pack. Three pin ignition coil check resistance between with multimeter setup home position. Check ignition coil simple ohm test position coil where you can access the pin. Ignition coil test power with transistor check resistance between ignition coil terminals as follows. Ignition coil the pins are number 1, 2, and 3. Check resistance between ignition coil terminals number 1 and 2 execute reading is 0 L, infinity resistance infinity sign, not 0. Check resistance between ignition coil terminals number 1 and 3 execute 0 L again reading is 0 L, infinity resistance infinity sign, not 0. Check resistance between ignition coil terminals number 2 and 3 execute 1.49 to 1.57 Com. Measure the resistance between the ignition coil test followed the lead holes using an ohm meter. Pini number 2 and Pini number 3. Specifications if 1.49 to 1.57 Combs is not specified, replace the ignition coil. But this ignition coil 1.52 Com is fine and works properly. Ignition coil is good. And remember that your car's ignition coil needs to be replaced if it is less than 1.49 combs and more than 1.57 combs. The reading for 1.52 comb, not zero for infinity infinity sign, the indicates that the ignition coil is good. Tell me pretty lies, look me in the face, tell me that you love me, even if it's fake.